And when a client submits an appointment request form, you will receive a notification for it. If you click on that notification, it takes you to the appointment request tab in the calendar. Another place that you can view your appointment request is through the dashboard and you'll see this appointment request block and from there you can click view as well. So you can get here two places through the notifications or the dashboard. From there, you can see the form that the client submitted, so that appointment request form. You can see what services they're looking for and how soon they want it and the days of the week. So after you take the time to look through your calendar, all you have to do is click this drop down and click add to calendar. From there, the client, the horse, the location, and the services fill in automatically. So all you have to do is select the date and the time and book the appointment. If you're all booked up and you don't have any appointments opening, you can add this client to your waitlist instead. Again, the client horse location services fill in as well as the client's available days and times. If for any reason you need to request a modification to the service that this client is looking for, or maybe provide some feedback to them, all you have to do is select request modification and enter in your reason and submit and it goes back to the client portal for the client to view or you can decline the appointment as well. So let's move this appointment to the calendar. And we'll say Wednesday at 9 a.m. I'm going to head over to my calendar. And right there, you can see the appointment on the 20th. That simple.